The difficulties of being a gentleman in today's society is how quickly women are willing to put themselves out there in sort of socially inappropriate ways on social media and sometimes in the interactive culture that we live in. I've certainly been solicited quite a lot since I've come to this town to begin my life over only to find that it really wasn't all it was made to be and it is my desire to leave the community here. I find that it has all these international and national brands but it doesn't have the eclectic culture that needs to support them to survive. We've lost several restaurants already on campus, multiple restaurants here out by the mall and shopping areas and the problem is kind of small-mindedness. But the truth is that a man with a larger vision for his life is looking for that new space. I loved where I used to live in the Carmel Knights Arts and Design District in my community because we were in a townhome and we could walk into the district and participate in all kinds of events, a car event, an art event, a food event, actual business events, and it was marvelous. And I do miss that townhome. But there was a point in which the community started to build itself up greater than the cottage area that it used to be in that area. They'd be putting in $400,000 houses on very small plots of land so they have next to no yard. And people like that. They're beautiful homes, but it changed the cost of living for my town home, which just was just one of four. An upstairs and a downstairs. And downstairs, we had a private classroom, and upstairs, We had a studio and some living quarters, and that's what I prefer to be. It's kind of the old-fashioned way of Chicago, New York, and other cities like Boston, where the businesses are a part of the family residence. It is a healthy way to live. I've always loved the shows that show those uh, older homes or those um, warehouse homes where there's sort of an upstairs and downstairs. It's also great for people who do things in dance because they have those marvelous wood floors to do things on. A Japanese home is tatami mats, but I'm allergic to tatami, so I wouldn't actually do that. I'd keep with the modernness of newer Japanese homes with wood floors. Now, when you ask me how I would build a home at this age and stage of my life, I want a ranch home, and I want a ranch home with two masters, but I'd like it to have some offshoots of wings. And some of the things that God was helping me to design in terms of the roofing, in terms of the areas of the family living quarters, in terms of the internal courtyard, and in terms of the way that windows would fit into the corners of the building was sort of fascinating. There is a truth to God that there should only be three peaks in a roof for the holiness of the home. When it has more, it opens itself up to difficulties and challenges for the family.